god! So we're going new game. Sometimes people make up things that aren't there. It seems like they're them that some entity controls their mind and their life. They do terrible things that can drive you crazy. I don't believe in the paranormal phenomena. I do believe, or I believe that there are trouble that people commit that are their own fault or those who brought them to this. And in order for you to believe, oh, that's Dexper. In for, order for you to believe your eyes and not fiction, I made revealing videos about paranormal. Oh, I didn't get to read the full thing. All right, let's check that out. Ooh, there's blood. The word bastard. Sin, you hate. Sorry. It's controlling itself for now. Pokemon in the chat, though. Oh, I have it. I searched all the corners, but I didn't find any evidence confirming paranormal activity in these houses. Now I'm going to an abandoned pioneer camp in Russia at the request of my subscribers to find out if the rumors of the locals have been talking about it for so many years are true. Let's go. They say that there are ghosts of dead people in this place and the hands of one of the residents, he himself was never found. The bodies of those people were also not found. Local residents avoid this place and those who, Jesus, who were touched by the tragedy do not allow to open the doors of this building in memory of the dead and missing. I come to Russia to investigate what happened to find out the rumors are true and to find the evidence of this. In keeping with my tradition, I close the doors of the building behind me so that there is no temptation to leave it. And I'm staying here for a few nights recording a report. I have a video camera, a sleeping bag, a backpack, and with things and food with me. <laughs> I was really trying to stay on topic and read because... They don't give me enough time, and apparently this time they gave me enough time. <laughs> oh, welcome to the Pioneer Camp. Let's go. Need to explore this camp. All right, so did I do this? Did I literally do that? Because that's kind of dumb. What up, Dragon? Welcome into the stream, my dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Did someone feed the feed the cats here? Jesus. That's good. I don't know why that scared me. You can't jump me because of something the game did. It's so rude. Yes, let's pretend that one was still up. What the heck? Like, that was literally... Somebody was literally, like, jiggling the handle, right? Wait, I can hear a cat. Hey, there's a cat. Well, duh, there's a cat. Don't, don't quote me on that. Jesus. Oh, heck no. They ain't doing the little ball thing. Oh, hell no. Nah. This thing looks creepy. That's saying something because I don't get scared of my dolls. What the fuck? It'll be dark soon. Need to look for candles. Oh, there's another doll. Oh, fuck no. Oh, there, there's how you crouch, apparently. Oh, what the shit? Okay, is that a nuclear alarm or is that the, um, the tornado warning?
This is Russia. So is this the nuclear alarm? I need to find a lighter or she says Um, it's like a little boy talking on the phone. Here we go. Oh, Jesus. Um, I can read. I need to get my Russian to English dictionary. Do I have that on me? What the heck? I know I can, but I'm waiting till dark. Jump me for things you didn't do. It's a little Russian doll. Oh, I actually got an achievement for that. That's awesome. You said I had supplies. How do you get the supplies? I'm literally clicking every single button I can think of. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. Nope. Are these my supplies? These have to be my supplies, right? Yeah. Okay. So these are my supplies. How do I put this down? All right. I didn't realize that that was going to just immediately turn on night time. Oh, it even turned on the lights. Awesome. Okay, how do you use the book though? Oh, what the fuck? Why am I using all three lighter? Rude. What am I supposed to do if I can't see? Am I supposed to take the camera? I can take the camera, can't I? Yep. There we go. There are legends that there was an orphanage near this camp, and there lived a strange girl who was afraid of water. She did not wash and did not go to the river. One day, the older girls decided to laugh at her, tied her hands, and poured water over her. She was very scared and ran away. They couldn't find her for many days, and they decided that she was dead. But one night, she came back in her pajamas, all wet, and killed everyone who bullied her. After that, her spirit appears in the bathroom on a full moon. I bet you want to bet that it's a full moon right now. an old lady now we can see what's inside the toilets which is nothing where are the flies coming from then do not throw cigarette butts awesome I can actually just approach things now and actually read them 
Respect the work of cleaners. God, that mask scared me. Where's the newspaper that I can pick up? You need to pick up a small mirror and stand in front of the large one make to make a corridor. Say three times, barefoot lady, show me my fates, and I will give you my shoes in return. Interesting. So for this being a camp, all I'm seeing is this, the inside of this house. Jesus, what the fuck? I don't care if this is like what my channel is doing. Like my channel, it means that I have two people, me and who, someone else who is doing this with me. I'm not doing this by myself. Oh, holy shit. God, this house, this, this thing. Give me the newspaper. I just want to read the newspaper that I was meant to read. Here, we got a first aid kit. Probably. It's the cat, right? What she says. Oh my God, I'm all jumpy on this one. The fuck? Oh, whatever it is, it's eating something. Oh, it closed the door on me. <sighs> Fucking shit, I'm locked in. Not gonna scare me. Not that one, at least. Hi, Owl. Welcome in. This game is terrifying. We're like, we're like 32 minutes in. Not, not even 32 minutes because it took me like 10 minutes to start stream. Oh, here you go. In 1958, towards the end of the summer, parents called the camp to find out that everything that Everything was all right with their children, but no one answered. Or find out if everything was all right. When they arrived at the camp, they found no one, only an abandoned things and mess. All the locals helped search for the missing children, but in vain. You're in loads of pain. I'm sorry, my dear. Ooh, I, yeah, I know what you mean. Probably, I've had that, but not like to your extent, probably. With Pioneer Ring March, we go aid of the elders. The pioneers grow brave and is not afraid of difficulties. <sighs> what am I supposed to do? The door is just locked. Um, I wonder if there's anything that I can use to undo that. Well, Pabs just went to jump to the windowsill and misjudged and fell <laughs> into the rain. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, Jesus. What the fuck? Wait a minute. Where are the covers? Head on in the head. This is a terrifying game. 
Is it bad that I still went to go look for the phone? I'm like, yeah, I see you, but like, where am I now? What the heck? There's pigeons. I can't read what it says. Of course I can't. I'm in a room. I know I'm in a room. <laughs> That's not what I'm asking. I'm asking how I got here. And how we opened up one of the doors. What the heck? Uh, please tell me that we... Well, yeah, it's where you are and I answered. That's not helpful. You said my camera and I don't know where my camera is still. I'm not mean. You are not boycotting my own stream. Is this not the camera? You're not welcome here. Yeah, that is the camera. But I had to pick up the piece of paper first. The one who hit me in the head took the candles. I have to figure out what is going on here. Of course they did. I need to turn on the lights in the entire building. Be clean, neat, pioneer, show an example in everything. I do not bully you all the time. That is not what happens. And hello, Kirby. I'm not a bully. Oh my goodness. I don't know why, but, but, um, uh, what is it called? Oh, there you go. Damn it. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so it still can't leave. Yeah, how are you, Kirby? Hope you're having a fabulous day. I'm terrified. Just a picture of a fence. What the heck? Who would you believe in? An innocent hour or someone who bullies? Oh my goodness, I'm not bullying you. There's just a carcass here. Actually, uh, the director of the Pioneer Camp, Yumos Maria, disappeared like the rest of the camp workers. Maria had previously taken care of children in an orphanage from 1944 to 1950. She was a caregiver who devoted herself only to work discipline was the most important thing to her so the parents entrusted their children to her oh dude the bird what the heck how there's more birds what the heck I'm not bullying any birds. They're dead. Oh my god, what am I supposed to look for in this room? Let 
There's a carcass here. That's all I can see. I am not a bully. If anything, I'm being bullied. Oh, you wouldn't bully me. Have it your way. All right, I don't like the fact that it said have it your way. We wouldn't know how, whatever, whatever. All right, so I'm taking this box with me, apparently. Oh my god. There we go. All right, editing goddess here. So early in the video, you can see I actually found where this was actually supposed to go. But what do I do instead? I go up to the light switch. Repeat after me. The light switch. Not the fuse box. The light switch. How do I put this fuse back in? This is a fuse, right? Maybe the fuse is here? Yeah, it is. There you go. There we go. Oh, that's not creepy at all. Let's not do that. I'm not a bully. Late at night when people fall asleep, no need for fun, no need for a fool. And the bells are empty and the eyes are full of bitterness. The carriers do not know what the Jesus is. The fool decides that enough is enough and he that night swore sad suits Poisons the court and the king. I'm sad at heart, but the plan is not a failure. The fool is no longer to me to be made fun of. All right, so that's talking about the little girl. Don't hit the child. It delays its development and spoils the character. Interesting that that would actually be there. A pioneer is ready to help kids without further ado. Yeah, I thought it'd be better with that, but no. Mm -mm. Okay, there's a mess. Oh god, the electricity is just so loud. I hate when it does that kind of stuff. Yeah, I really don't care that it's going to be dark soon. We've only just woken up like two seconds ago. High voltage is life-threatening.
An investigation is underway of the disappearance of the children and employees of the Pioneer Camp, which was opened in 1955. Under the leadership of Director, the suspect in the case is a child living in this camp. The name is Zukov. Evidence of the victim was found in his locker. What happened to him and where he is is now unknown. They haven't done enough scary stuff. They need you to sleep, Eloa. Honestly. I want to sleep. Fine. He just starts screaming at me to sleep. The second night's in the camp um, came Oh fuck, no. Did the children get turned into dolls? I swear, every time I turn around- Oh shit! <sighs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, damn. Is that my breathing? Please be, make that be my breathing. Well, yeah, if I have lights, why the fuck am I walking around with a camera? Where am I supposed to put this? I obviously can't reach. Yes, let's pretend that that's where the lights go. Okay, how do you turn back on? Okay, so there we go. What the heck? It just stops. Shit. 
Oh my god, I cannot with this game right now. You're enjoying this, aren't you, babe? Okay, I'm less freaked out by the dolls right now. Yes. You gotta wait five seconds. It's so p multiple people can't jump me at the exact same time. Oh, Jesus. So rude. So mean. You know, I'm pretty convinced. You know what? We can leave now. I'm convinced. This place is haunted. Awesome. What the heck? You saw a garb? Just a picture of a, uh, whatever those things are called. Nope, that one didn't scare me. Oh, there's the key. Let's see what else does it say. From 1950, a loud scandal in an orphanage for orphanage for orphans. Really? An orphanage? We're orphans. What else is the orphanage for? <laughs> I need... I need the screen. Excuse you. From 1950, a loud scandal in an orphanage for orphans. The nurse cruelly mocked the residents. One of the employees reported violence of or violations of authority. A decision is made to close the institution we recommend that you <laughs> we remind you that the shelter was open since 1944. Children who were left without parents during the wars lived there. Oh, so the saddest of the kids. Like, it's one thing to not have parents, but to have parents and then lose them. I guess it all works the same thing. Dear Diary, today is the annual opening day of my camp. I have been prepared for this for three years so that this summer will be special for me. During these days, I will help bring up real people in them, but they will also help me a lot. Interesting. Night of 58. Okay, so we're learning something now. After a severe thunderstorm, there is no lights in the building. Guessing a flashlight? So this is back when it actually was new. Or new-ish.
I heard a uh, relaxer just destroyed a whole base and I was in the middle of making wood into stone. Aw, I'm sorry, my dear. Caregivers are asleep. I won't bother them. The children and caregivers are asleep. All the names of the kids. Interesting. Anna, we need to run. It's all because of the director. I was spying on her. She was talking about how something bad about talking to someone about something bad. You have to believe me. Warn everyone. We don't have much time and until I hide her key in the closet. So we can make it help me. Pokemon in the chat. What an asshole. Oh, this thing I hate is little music box things. Oh, Jesus. You filthy child. I'm guessing one of the kids is being... Okay, so I'm the director, so I'm female, so that's my breathing. Oh, there's another dead bird. You found the evidence. I need to spray sleeping gas so all the children can be transferred to the hospital for surgery and then return back. What the fuck? We worked together with in an orphanage that I acted carelessly and received a complaint. The director had to close the shelter. I was suspended from medical work. Now I will not make such a mistake because only he knows about the agreement. I must continue to find people for him to collect their kidneys and he will help me perform a heart transplant operation for Ivan according to all the incidents from the medical records is an ideal donor. I'll set up an accident and no one will ever look for him. Uh, he become, And he became my favorite because he is so similar to my son Ivan. I really want to see him. Yokov is a good boy, although he does not speak, but he understands everything and does everything I ask. In the afternoon, I had to meet with him at the shelter where we used to work. He ordered us to fill an agreement tonight. This day has come. Yokov will help me with this. Before going to bed, children will invent horror stories. While the counselors put them to bed, this can distract them. Okay, so the missing boy. My God, I need to be able to walk forward. What the heck? What the heck?
Yeah, I think I died. You were told, crossed out, to get out of here. Leave this place alone. The empty page left in Maria's diary. You can use them to answer. I hear him outside the door. I knew what happened here. Let me help you. Tell me who you are. I thought again for a minute I was going to see the little girl. Why wouldn't it just let me pick up the phone? That'd be awesome just hearing some Russian. Oh, Jesus. I read, I read that people were killed here. Did you do that? Tell me. Then I can help you. Chances are that that'd be the little boy, right? I was accused, but I didn't do it. Get out of here. Oh. Oh, Jesus. The children be scaring me, like, seriously. Nope, that didn't scare me. Is your name Yokov? Have you been living alone for many years? Okay, let's try that again. What the heck? Okay, nope. I don't need to write anymore. Yes. Here, I can communicate with my friends. We guard this place because it's our home. A lot of people come here just to break our things. But my friend helps me drive away strangers. I'm afraid that someone will see me and tell them I live here and those people will come for me. Welcome back. Okay, so this kid is alive? Who are your friends? And are they here too? It's creepy. Here we go. The spirits of this place, those who were tortured here, they remained locked up here. That day in the evening after the lights went, light, after lights out, somebody came. Possibly it was a person with whom the director spoke. He didn't find me. I think that's because of this. He poisoned all the residents and the director. Dang. Oh dear. I like the added detail that I actually used the um, the English to Russian translator. All this was planned by the director of the camp. What are you talking about? What kind of person was she talking to?
It's all her. I saw the director talking to somebody in an old hospital near the camp. They agreed that they would do their work at night. Then I realized that it was connected with us, but I couldn't warn everyone. I didn't see who was there because I was scared and hid. In the morning, I went into the building and found no one. Her safe was also not there. I thought the man and his assistant had taken everyone away and hid in the bodies in the building. I had to stay here and live in the ventilation only sometimes go to the rooms. Okay, so he's living in the walls. The building abandoned. Can they get there? I was scared and I didn't know it would end there. I trusted her, my friend Anna. I'm sorry for not being able to stop this. It doesn't answer anymore. It's time to go to the abandoned hospital. Okay, we're loading. Night three. I thought we were going to the hospital. You have said I could find proof here. Let's take a look around. Okay. So that's just the door. More chains. So you're at the hospital? Yeah, I guess I traveled. Pokemon in the chat, guys. Oh, heck no. Why is there so much movement in a hospital that's... 1946 after the war dozens of children ended up in shelters after losing their parents an orphanage for the maintenance and upbringing for orphans worked under the leadership of the military isn't there a door back there what the heck There's the door that I need to open. That's not ominous at all. Oh, look, more dolls.
the doctor of the orphanage was detained for illegal organ trafficking for six years. He fraudulently made innocent diagnosis and performed operations to remove the kidneys. The director did not know of this, but he could not continue to lead his position. The orphanage was closed and the building became abandoned. This one leads to another corridor. I have an angle grinder in my backpack. I can cut all the chains and find what evidence is hidden. Of course, I happen to have an angle grinder. Oh, dear lord. Oh, of course, this became. This place won't let me go. I have to finish what I started. Oh, dear. God, that's loud. There's a refrigerator here. Probably smells like crazy. I know what I'm doing is wrong, but I have no choice. I have to save my sign, Ivan. I was lucky that Alex agreed to help, but mustn't let him down. No one should know about our affairs. Great. Oh, that sets my teeth on edge. It's the dolls, I'm telling you. It's all the little dolls. I don't have time to save him. I don't believe it. This can't be happening. This is not my van checka. I'll save him. I need to find a donor urgently. Oh, please make that so much quieter. I don't know if I'll make it to the morning because today's shift is bothering me. I want to run away from here, but I won't get paid. I hear voices as if I'm not alone. I thought I saw a woman more like her silhouette or shadow. She went to the closet. I'm afraid to follow her and move the closet. I don't want to check if it's true. And maybe it's just my imagination, which has sharpened after a glass of vodka on the cabinets weigh some products made of feathers and cobwebs i have never seen them anywhere they look terrible and smell of dead things from there okay i'll have another glass and go to bed until morning another doll Oh, she's this! Holy shit! Great. We're back to not being able to go through that door. 
Oh my god, this game is so scary. Oh, and the door just me. She says. It's another one of these dogs. Oh, Jesus. A year later, after the events in 1950, the building was reclassified as a hospital. But with budget cuts, it's all working again. A dream catcher. Jesus. How had her body not decomposed after all these years? Let those who find me feel the pain of a mother who lost her child. I curse everyone who couldn't help me, and I'm not just going to leave. I'll be back. Here are the documents from 1958. Alex, whom Maria spoke, replied to her that he would no longer participate in this and refused to work with her. Then, what was the case in question, and who was she talking to when Yokov saw her? There was something else to the death certificate documents. This is her son, Ivan. He died in the fall of 1950. Apparently she couldn't stand it and went crazy and wanted to save him so badly that she lost touch with reality. Poor woman. Death certificate. Yeah, there it is. He died. 1950. Of course there's no door to get out. Why wouldn't there be? Oh, it's because I didn't take it. What she meant by that? How she how would she return? Maria, I'm so sorry. Who put all these candles here? The dead and buried. It's scary. <gasps> okay, I think. That's all I can get from the hospital. Yep, the door is available again. Did the door just open like that? Three weeks? I spent three weeks here? Oh, heck nah. Heck nah. 
return to the camp. It took me three weeks to return to the camp. Where's my pack? Hey, Yakov, you no longer need to be afraid that you will be found and accused of something that you did not do. I've taken care of everything. I didn't tell anyone that you lived here with your friends. Protect this place furthermore. Now it's rightfully only your home. Your, uh, your friend, Alex Morton. I'm glad this investigation turned out to be so interesting and unique. I managed to solve the mystery of 58 and help Yoka find peace and freedom. You can read about this in my blog, but we need to move on. I'm going to another place with a terrible history where witches used to live, and there I will have an unusual case. I will tell you about it later. So is that the full game? It's a scary little full game. Pokemon in the chat, guys. A few days later. Okay. From day to day. Okay. Battery is dead, of course it is. I had to wait for the person who brought who bought this house. But after his arrival a few days later, something went wrong. This place had ceased to be harmless. I'm trapped here. I don't think that a woman from a shelter in Russia could get attached and follow me. Does this house have a pendulum for people like her? What if some other spirits followed me? Maybe that's why I didn't find anyone in those houses. I miraculously managed to escape from the abandoned orphanage, but I am not sure that I will be released now. We need to try and get out and warn the guy that it's dangerous to stay here. Okay then. So there's more story, interesting. Oh heck no, I hate that. Why can't I just take that with me? Oh shit! Thank you.